Greetings. I've got a blurb here for you about a copy of SimCity 2000 that I have never run across until now. This is the SimCity 2000 three and a half inch HD interactive demo disc. I need to check it out. This was actually sold at retail. I think one of those uh, just like little checkout counter type of things. Don't actually know because there's just not much information about these types of releases. But here's one. And really the only way that I knew that it was even a thing before this was just seeing it listed in various, shall we say, abandoned wear collections over the years. The SimCity 2000 Interactive Demo. I'm like, what in the world is that? You know, like, I don't know. Couldn't find much about it except that some folks had found it and copied it and shared it online. But here is the original thing. So... I don't know. As a SimCity 2000 collector, I think this is pretty special. You just don't see retail demo discs, especially from Maxis. I think it's awesome. A nice tidy little sleeve, a little bigger than I thought it was actually. It's not that little. In fact, compared to uh, a jewel case. Like, yeah, it's got some size difference. I don't know why they did that, considering it's just a single three and a half inch floppy disk in there, but um, here it is. So yeah, printed uh, with a label in the exact same style as the retail game. Got a different serial number on there. Yeah. And you even get a manual, which again, you just don't see this very often. I mean, demo discs, sure, you got them in magazines. Sometimes you'd get the other versions of, of demos with a, uh, just like included on a CD, or sometimes you'd get an extra demo disc with like a retail game. But this being sold on its own, again, as far as I know, and then having this classy of a presentation, this is special. And again, the only copy I have ever come across. Granted, I haven't been actively looking for it. It just happened to show up as a eBay-related item as I was looking for other SimCity-related things. But I mean, look at this, this manual. <laughs> it's like a full walkthrough of whatever's in the demo. This is, uh, this is not shareware. It's just so, I don't know, it's just slightly different enough for me to uh, want to do a blurb video about this fascinating stuff. So yeah, let's install it. All right, got the Megalumina monster going here. Let's get it installed and see what it's like. Where's the disk drive? There it is. Okay, some similar files, but a lot less. Actually, there is a readme in here too. So let us... SimCity 2000 demo, last minute info. <laughs> that seems to be pretty much just all troubleshooting stuff, which there were a lot of things to troubleshoot with SimCity 2000 for DOS. Yeah, mostly pertaining to video cards, sound cards, <laughs> stuff about mouse drivers, memory issues, oh man. SimCity 2000 under OS2, I guess they were still concerned about that. I mean, it makes sense. There was also a SimCity 2000 uh, version for OS2, which I actually have. That I've been meaning to show that at some point. It's in the box and everything. Not too many OS2 games were released, but I've got a couple. Anyway, no mention of sound at all, so I'm assuming maybe there is no sound. Let us uh, go ahead and install it, though, and we shall see. All right, got the familiar Maxis setup going on. Your computer has 1,024K of installed RAM. Uh, there's a bit more than that. I think there's 512 megs in this system, but that's probably the issue. It just uh, doesn't know how to recognize that much. Okay, SC2K demo. There we go. Yep. Nice. So we even get to license the demo to ourselves. Oh, okay. Choose a Super VGA card. <laughs> just, that's, that's the only one you get. Uh, 
Oh no, here, there, here, there's the full list. Yeah. That's pretty much everything that the main game comes with too. So we'll just go with classic Visa Super VGA here. All right, so it looks like we've got <laughs> the README again. Okay, installation complete. I will enjoy the demo. I'm just curious though. Yeah, it has uh, like a setup program. Yeah, I'm just wondering about sound, you know? Okay, no, there's no sound option at all. So I guess that's one reason, uh, or one way, that they got it down to one disc. They just cut sound completely. And of course, it'd be another incentive to get the full version. Yay, the background's still animated. Ooh, just goes straight to this. Welcome to the SimCity 2000 interactive demo. In this demo, you'll get a chance to explore the new features in SimCity 2000 and get started on building your own metropolis. Uh, hold down shift for, yeah, that thing. The demo will end after 20 minutes. Fascinating. So it's just a straight up timed demo. <laughs> well, dang, that's pretty cool. Looks like it's going real fast. Was that on Cheetah? Yep. All right. So you're going to do a little, little demo city here with Elfish River. Shout out to L Fish. Fascinating game. Or kind of a game. Anyway, let's see here. We've got <laughs> no ability to load cities. Can't edit new maps, load scenarios, save cities. That makes sense, I suppose. Uh, looks like the same about window here. All the speed options are here. No sound or music, of course. We got one fire. Our one, one disaster option, which is just fire. Can we still shoot down the helicopter? Yep. <laughs> so we can do that at least. You click the helicopter with a little crosshair uh, move thingy and that's that. Those fire graphics look slightly different if I'm not mistaken. And actually it looks like it's kind of, yeah, it sort of doesn't work. It crashed the helicopter, but it didn't cause fires around it. It just sort of stuck there. <laughs> That's interesting. Oh, man. Yeah, all the graphics look pretty much the same, though, from what I'm remembering. Like, that might be a little bit different. That kind of stands out. I don't know. Who knows? It'd be interesting to do a complete side-by-side -side comparison with all the sprites, see if anything changed between the demo and the full version. But, you know, for the most part, like 99%, this looks just like SimCity 2000, but cut down um, just pretty much what you'd expect for a demo. I also don't see, like, a timer counting down or anything. So who knows how long of the 20 minutes we have left. Not that I plan on playing this for 20 minutes in this video, but, you know. All right, let's start a new city, and let's just, uh, you know, start in the year 2000. It's so weird to not have any music or sound. <laughs> it kind of brings me back to playing this on my Packard Bell 486 with no sound card. Anyway. Ah, look at all these not availables. The only thing that you get is coal. What happens if you click one of the other ones? Sorry, this feature is not available in the demo. Yep. All right, so we've got coal. <laughs> it's very snappy not having any sounds, though, that's for sure. Usually you get, or sometimes you can get a slight delay depending on the system you're playing on. This is just like laying stuff down. No sound effects needing to play at all. Oh. So it shows what would unlock, but you can't actually place anything. There's all four Arcos. Ah, you can't at least click the info. Neat. This would, yeah, this would have gotten me really excited for the full game, as if I wasn't already excited enough back in the day. Oh my goodness. Uh, I just, I dreamed of this game for so long. 
or felt like so long. It's probably only like a year, but <laughs> you know, I'm a kid, just completely obsessed with it. That's how it was. Played it in my friend's house because he had the full version of the game, and it was awesome. It was actually the special edition with uh, yeah, CD-ROM, like little FMV interviews with Will Wright and whatnot. A cool intro video. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, like, I swear that particular construction sprite, some of those look a little different to me. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm kind of curious. If, uh, if it is just my imagination or, or who knows. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's SimCity 2000. A good chunk of it, honestly. Like, I mean, for a demo, not bad at all. It seems to be more or less feature complete. Just, of course, you don't get some of the later things, like you no know, water treatment plants, desalinization, and, of course, none of the special buildings. You can build seaports and airports, though. Small parks, big parks, no, zoom, no zoos, stadiums, or marinas, but we get a big park. That's nice. You get police. Have just normal schools. You can do that. <laughs> this would be a terribly balanced city if this was the real game, but whatever. It's going to time out after 20 minutes anyway, right? So who cares? Nah, this is awesome. This this is really cool. Again, I don't know precisely how it was distributed. You know whether or not it was. Like actually sold in stores, or if it was uh, just one of those things that you got as a bonus. Like I remember when I worked retail, a lot of times I'd be selling people games, and you'd get something else from the publisher, and it'd be like uh, one of those things you'd have to ring up at the register. You know, hence you got the UPC there, but it would ring up as free, and you would just get it with something else. I don't know if it's one of those, or if it was actually sold. Or something else. Like, I just don't know. I haven't been able to find precise information about this thing. I just noticed my monitor is like... There we go. Anyway, so if anybody knows how exactly this was released, or distributed, I guess is more of the question. Was it actually sold? Who knows? Either way, though, it's fascinating to see just a standalone demo like this. And it's awesome to actually have found the physical thing after having seen it for so many, many years on abandoned wear sites and wares collections and just random compilations of DOS games that I've found and torrents over the years. Like, seriously, going back to, I guess, the early 2000s when I first started discovering that stuff. <laughs> I'm like home of the underdogs and uh, various... Just, just random boards that sh uh, distributed stuff. And, uh, yeah, a lot of it was the first time I was ever seeing it. And that's the first time I, I figured out that this existed. I just, I never saw it back in the day. Very familiar with SimCity 2000, of course. But this interactive demo? Nope. Never saw it anywhere. My city is completely falling apart. That's fine. Let's add some fires. Hey. Nice. Wow. <laughs> That is a brutally effective fire. <laughs> okay, yeah, those those explosion sprites look different, and, like, so does the rubble. Check it out. I know for sure that's different. So there are some different graphics, some slightly different things here to admire in this interactive demo. All right, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to see what was different, if anything, you know, what things were limited how it was like to install and play and, and all that kind of stuff. That, uh, here it is. It is uh, a fascinating release, for sure. And the fact that it was released in any kind of physical manner with a manual and proper packaging and just... They, they went and did kind of a lot for a demo. But this is a monumental game and it, it deserves it. So, uh, yeah, if you'd like to check this out, I will put a link in the video description where you can download this. And I'll put some scans as well because I just... I like this art. 
And yeah, that's it for this LGR blurb. Thank you very much for watching. Oh, because I have no firefighters. <laughs> what was that? <sighs> they sent the National Guard, but I couldn't place them because that's blocked off. Or maybe it just went by too fast. What's going on? There was a hurricane randomly, too. I didn't think hurricanes were in this. It's not available. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching.